Dearly beloved, you are gathered here in the presence of family and many friends to begin your journey through life together. I got to know Josh when we started teaching at the same school eight years ago. Relaxed, fun-loving, and creative are all attributes that I would use to describe Josh. When I recently met Kim, I saw a wonderful connection between them, probably because they were great friends for the first three years of their relationship. At first meeting, Kim was incredibly thoughtful and poised, and they easily turned to one another while we made decisions. They met each other dancing, and I predict that there will be a great partnership for years to come as they dance through life. Kim, from the first step I took into Connolly's, I knew where I wanted my future to be. Although my courage was off to a late start, I am so glad I asked you to dinner that one night. You are the most beautiful, strong, and caring woman I know. There is not a morning I wake up to that I wouldn't want you by my side. We have our whole lives ahead of us. The chapters are just beginning. I vow to make you the most happiest woman in the world, and my heart belongs to only you. Here's to a lifetime of happiness, love, and growing old together. I love you. Josh, I am proud to take you as my husband. You have helped me triumph over challenges presented, encouraged my personal growth, and boosted my self-esteem. You have helped me become the person I am today, and with your help, I will be a better person tomorrow than I was yesterday. I vow to trust and value your opinion. I vow to always treat you as my best friend and equal. I vow to listen for as long as it takes you to feel heard. I vow to always admire your huge, strong, kind, and determined heart. <laughs> I vow to watch the latest Marvel movies and TV <laughs> series with you. DC Comics are negotiable. <laughs> and I vow that I will love you. kindergarten teacher, I would like to share a poem about the meaning of the colors in a crayon box that we all first get when we're about four or five, and how they relate to a marriage and its relationships. <laughs> Brown signifies the earth from where we came and to where we will ultimately return. Green symbolizes growth. May your marriage grow in the same beautiful way that the trees and the flowers grow black, we identify this color with the pains, sorrow, and despair that will inevitably occur in our lives over the many years. Blue is the color of the dove, representing peace. May this peace always have a place in your daily lives. Hmm. Purple re represents respect and dignity, key components of a successful marriage. Orange is the symbol of brightness, May the two of you always have brightness and sunshine in your life together. Yellow is the color of happiness. And may you always be as happy in the future as you are today. And finally, red is the color of love. 
May your marriage be filled with love. And remember, never hesitate to say, I love you, with the beginning and ending of each day. Remembering what the crayons and their colors represent will be helpful in making your marriage grow. Now that you have joined yourselves in solemn matrimony and have become one, may you both sincerely strive all your lives to meet this commitment with the same love, devotion, and energy that brought you both here today. As we come to the conclusion of our ceremony, Josh and Kim have both chosen a tradition that signifies the union of two lives into one. First, from the Jewish tradition, Josh will break the glass which represents the joining of two souls as one to live a life together in fidelity and love. And I truly hope to hear a resounding mazel tov after that happens. <laughs> the second tradition is called jumping the broom. And this was a ceremony dating back to the 1600s from Africa. It is symbolic of binding a couple to marriage and can also symbolize fertility and prosperity for the couple. Josh and Kim will sweep away their former single lives, former problems and concerns, and jump over the broom to enter upon a new adventure as husband and wife. Ready? <laughs>